Hey, I'm Dude What's Up, and no matter if you're a brand new player or a veteran from the last beta test for the cycle, this video will have everything you need to know for your first day. And also, if you're in a rush and you like just want to see a specific task or where to find certain items, I'll have everything timestamped in the description below. Starting off, after you complete the tutorial, they try to start you off with a pistol. I would recommend an SMG because it sucked last beta, but it's actually pretty good this beta. Got him! He's dead! Foam that boy up real quick! Also, if you remember the bolt action from last wipe, it's not that great of a gun anymore. It's seven grand. It doesn't come with a scope anymore? A good thing to keep in mind is against striders, the small guys, you can one tap knife them if you hold down your knife button and charge it up. So with this patch, they've added these things called elites. They're basically regular creatures, but they are like have a silver tint to them and they're super strong, super fast, and they take a lot more damage to kill. Normal striders take like three bullets to kill. This one took three mags. Oh, we're alive. So yeah, if you guys see those, uh, those gray dudes, don't even fight them. Be very careful of fall damage because there's a lot of tall things in this game and you can die very easily from it. Let's go water facility, try to find- Oh fuck! That was a much farther fall than I wanted to. Always keep in mind your life is valuable. You want to make it out with whatever you have on you, so don't be afraid to retreat. He has green armor. And if worse comes to worse, always remember that no, that is your default one. key to talk to other people. You <laughs> could always just try to beg for your life, and uh, you know it works. Some Yo, all I got is a pistol, bro. Come on, leave me alone. I'll leave. I'll literally go away. Thank you. Anytime you see a plume of smoke in the distance, it's most likely a meteor, and I would always recommend checking those out if you're confident in not dying because the meteor cores are worth a lot. They craft into the best armor in the game. It's always worth mining. Lastly, before we get into the tasks, the way you find keys in this game is mostly through jackets. I've heard of finding them other ways, but I've only ever found them inside of jackets. Starting off with the tasks, one of the first ones I had trouble with was finding striders in the swamp area. I could not find them anywhere, and at the very end of my task, I ended up finding where all of them spawn at. This is the location on the map. The next task I go over is where you find the SOS you sign on the beach. Here's the SOS sign. There's the location. You can find blast ticks all around the rock pools area of the map. Oh, nice, nickel, I need that. And blast ticks, oh nice! You can find water weed almost anywhere that there is water on the map. I found all of mine in the swamp area. You can actually see I walked past one right here. I have a setting wrong or some shit. Ooh, is that a water weed? It is. Give me that. Nice, we got the water weed secured, even if we die. You can find azure wood in the woodcutter camp and the labs area, most of the time on tables or inside of cabinets. The best way to find the blue stones you need to mine, cloudy, clear, all of those different stones, is I go up to waterfall at the very top of the map and follow this river down and you'll find at least eight or nine different like veins of the ore you find so much of it up there so yeah just follow the river and you'll find tons of the stuff i think i found eight or nine different veins on this one run you can find these items called blue runner eggs if you follow the footsteps on the ground when they appear and they also added this like weird white aura thing to them this uh this patch as well One of your tasks requires you to kill five creatures at the base camp. There is a marauder that hangs out here, so I would recommend avoiding him and doing what I do here and just killing a few striders and then running away. Yo, what's good, Wash? How we doing, my boy? Oh! 
that one tap knife strat comes in handy here. Pure luck I didn't get hit here. For the last task I'm going to show you in this video, this is how to get into the loot room for one of your tasks. You have to go around and find these three different batteries all around the area, and you have to put them inside of these slots outside of the door. Here we go. I don't know if you can hear me, but I found one of them. <clears throat> Looks like there might be another one up there, bro. Did another Oh, no, he's at, it's at the top of the water tower. I see it. It's all the way up there at the water. T okay, cool. You found the last one. Oh yeah, where was the other one at? It was on top of the the like scaffolding on those water purifiers over there. Like Yeah, I just need a circuit board. You can have everything else inside if there is a circuit board in here. For this task, you have to go all the way back right in the room, and there's a picture you have to pick up and turn in. Well, that's the last task for this video. I'll probably have another video out tomorrow or the next day going over the next few tasks and where to find your next few items. Um, if you learned anything from this video, I would really appreciate if you left me a like, a comment, and hit that subscribe button. I literally played the game for 10 hours today getting all this content, and then another four hours took another four hours to edit this video completely together so i put in tons of work for this guide um if you learned anything like i said like it would mean a ton if you could hit that like button and subscribe also i'm live every single day on twitch if you have any questions um as soon as this video goes live i'll have beta key drops enabled so you can come and watch my channel and you can earn yourself a beta key and play the game yourself if you don't already have it and um yeah without anything else man i appreciate you guys watching to the end of the video man i really do mean that seriously thank you a ton and i hope you have a great rest of your day see you in the next video peace